In a previous video, I made a tip jet helicopter out of balsa and plywood parts that used model rocket engines to spin the blade and create lift. Its first test flight would take place on Shurn Dry Lake. Due to a faulty ignition system, only one of the mortars ignited which destroyed the helicopter. After fixing the helicopter and adding some improvements, it was ready for test flight 2. Once again, it is apparent that only one of the motors ignited, which destroyed the helicopter on the ground. This is very similar to Test Flight 1. Another similarity is that after they get destroyed, a section of the rotor breaks off and spirals out of control. In test flight 1, the rotor flew harmlessly into the sky, but in test flight 2, the rotor hit the plywood barrier we had in place. Two dents in the plywood are visible as well. After bouncing off the plywood barrier, the rotor flies into the sky. All of these issues stem from a faulty ignition system and how measures were not taken after test flight 1 to stop an issue like this from happening again. Another update is that the Tipjet helicopter program will be paused due to safety reasons. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing.